Hello friends, my name is Srinivas and welcome to my channel Tech Studio 8. In this video, I am going to show you how to download Oracle SQL Developer from the official website that is Oracle site. And also, we will connect to the Oracle, Oracle Database 18C Express Edition. Okay, and we will also configure some of the users, okay, uh, system user and uh, we will also create one user and we will create we will con we will also connect hr schema and uh, we will execute sql scripts and most of the sql developers well known scott schema also we will config firstly we will download the oracle sql developer from the official website that is oracle site okay i will show you how to do that open the google in the web browser and search with the keyword sql developer press enter you can see sql developer oracle this is from the official site. You can see www.oracle.com. Okay, click on that. It will be directed to the official site oracle.com. You can see Oracle SQL Developer. You, uh, in the below, SQL Developer Data Modeler Web SQL. So I am downloading SQL Developer. Click on that SQL Developer. You can see SQL Developer 20.2 download something. The version is 20.2. Uh, based on your operating system platforms, you can download. I am downloading for the Windows operating system, so Windows 64 bit with JDK 8 included. Okay, I am downloading that. It is some 494 MB. Just click on the download. Uh, accept the terms Oracle. Download. Now you need to have a Oracle account to download this. Guys, this is as creating Oracle account is as simple as Gmail account. Okay, just create one Oracle account. It will be very useful for you. Just give the credentials. I am giving the credentials and signing in. Your download will start now. See your download got started, and um, it depends upon your uh, internet connection, bandwidth of your internet connection. Mine is some two Mbps, so it will take hardly for three minutes. Okay, the file got successfully downloaded in the download folder. You can see in the downloads folder. Okay, SQL developer, right click and extract. The file got extracted. Okay, double click on that. One more time, SQL developer. Okay, in the below, you can see SQL developer application. Guys, one thing, uh, it is a standalone application. So every time you need to double click this application. Okay, you don't need to install this. Okay, double click your application got started. It's loading. Oracle SQL developer loading. Now we will start configuring the users in the Oracle developer. Okay, I will show you how to do that. So you can see the welcome page. That's a welcome page. You can see scroll down. You can see something startup okay now we don't have any connections by cl by clicking on plus button you can create a new connection right now i'm creating a connection for system okay you just give a meaningful name as system underscore xc whatever the name you can give but it should be identified okay username as system and uh, password tiger at the time of installation i have given password tiger okay now let it be the local host and uh, the port is 1521 and the SID is XE but pluggable database this is a pluggable database guys XCP DP1 at the time of installation you can see this okay the first one uh, container and the second one is a pluggable database and the third one is the express URL okay that is the pluggable database XCP DP1 this is very important because this is the express edition that I am configuring okay test it you can see success and connect it just wait system dot e underscore exe okay this is it now I'm just selecting some tables just I would like to show you select star from tab execute it so you can see all these metadata tables all these things you can see below all these things okay now we have successfully configured system okay i will create one more user 
from this create from this system itself okay create user text studio 82 identified by text studio uh, identify by one two three four five okay execute it see user text studio 82 created okay now i will give you grant permissions for this okay grant connect resource unlimited table space to text studio 82 okay execute it yeah see grant succeeded now i will configure this text studio 82 in a sql developer one more connection i will create okay click on press button now give the user name name uh, i am giving as text studio 82 only text studio 82 okay and username as text studio 82 and password is 12345 yes okay 12345 that one okay i have created password 12345 and the um, once again xcp dp1 okay i have created in that pluggable database only just test it okay success and connect it you can see the status success and connect okay now just as a query some select uh, with select tables select star from tab so right now we don't have any data tables for in this just you can see just execute it okay that's it no tables we will create one table okay uh, in the scott schema you can see one table sal grade i am going to create that one just copy it and paste it okay see that one create sal grade uh, all the with these columns execute it okay table will be created see table sal grade created successfully and now i am going to insert some five records into this okay execute it that's it all the file records got inserted i am going to commit it just commit button okay commit click on the commit one okay now just query that table select star from cell grade You can see select star from tab so you can see that uh, table got entry in the metadata table now i am going to select star from sal grade execute it you can see that inserted rows okay guys now i am going to show you how to execute the sql script okay firstly i will create the user scott identified by the tiger okay with the password i will show you how to do it okay create user scott identified by tiger okay execute it see users got created and now i'm going to give the permissions grant connect resource unlimited table space to scott okay grant succeeded now i am going to connect this scott schema okay give the new connection name as or underscore scott underscore schema okay give the username as scott and the password as tiger and here uh, service name as xcpdp1 which is a pluggable database just test it the status got succeeded success you can see the success okay connect it okay you have successfully connected see you can see that or underscore scott underscore schema okay select star from tab nothing you can see see there is no entries now i am going to execute that sql script okay this is a sql script okay now okay i am just showing in the edit page. see this is a schema okay you can see that i directly connecting to scott and tiger create table department emp table 
and the sal grade table and bonus table okay and also i am going to execute some insert into uh, insert the records into this okay by within the sql script only okay from the file file open i am at the desktop it is in the desktop okay that one okay you can see here now you need to execute the entire script sql script okay just go to that yeah execute it it will pop up and uh, you can see the connections now for the first connection itself aura underscore scott underscore schema okay click on okay see it automatically got disconnected also so you can see the entire things all the rows got successfully inserted see we have executed the sql script also successfully okay now we are going to connect hr schema i already uh, unlocked the hr schema in the below description you can see how to unlock hr schema video okay i have okay, i have made one video now i am going to configure that hr schema new connection give a name as hr underscore hr give the username as hr and password as hr and the service name as xcpdp1 i am just configuring all this is just test i already unlocked this one okay hr schema you can see in the below description the video link status success and connect it just query some tables select start from tab just execute it so you can see all these tables departments employees okay uh, i will check one of the select star from employees see so you can see the uh, all the records of this employees table in the hr schema okay that's it guys we have successfully downloaded the oracle sql developer from the official oracle websites itself okay for and also configured users in sql developer by connecting to oracle database 18c express edition yes it is express edition we have successfully created users and uh, we have successfully executed the sql script and we have successfully configured the hr schema also okay thanks for watching my video if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to press bell icon for more updates don't forget to share my videos with your friends please give your valuable comments in the comment section part thanks for watching thank you guys